So the other day I'm laying up in bed and just thinking about a whole lot of nothing, admittedly. And for whatever reason, my mind drifted to that very important moment where a butcher is just about to take the life of an animal that doesn't really want to die, at least doesn't show signs of doing that. Because, you know, last I checked, I haven't seen a single video of a, an animal willingly waltzing into a kill floor to have its head chopped off, to be chambered in gas, and to be hung upside down to have its throat slit. And, uh, you know, correct me if I'm wrong, I've never seen that. If you have, please feel free to tag me. But I couldn't help but to think what would actually be going through a butcher's mind right before they're about to take a life. And I can't help but to think that they are either some sort of influence, whether it's drugs or heavily intoxicated through inebriation or something like that, or they just simply consciously suppress every single bit of humanity they have in them in order to do a job that under any other circumstances they probably wouldn't do if it at least didn't play well. And so I am looking to maybe have that conversation with somebody who is presently in that field because I definitely want to pick their brain as to how they go about their daily life, punching a clock, you know, going home, putting food on their table as a result of breaking families on an everyday basis. And so I would love to have a conversation with somebody that is either a slaughterhouse worker, a butcher, factory farm owner, or anyone along these lines of not only sponsoring, but literally making a living as a result of murdering sentient, living, breathing creatures. So if you know of anybody, if you think that we would have a great conversation, feel free to slide into my DMs, tag them, or tag me in any of their profiles. I would love to have a one-on-one -on -one conversation, sort of like interview style debate, and maybe get to the bottom of how they process doing what they do.